Your five senses are keys to understanding the world around you, but not everyone experiences these senses the same way. Let's say you're sitting at a desk in a quiet library, studying for a big test, but something is distracting you. You lose focus on your work and instead are only thinking about that sound. Your senses are trying to perceive the sound harmoniously, but instead it causes chaos in your brain and it won't stop. Eventually you give up on studying altogether. This is a common experience, but for many, this lack of harmony happens so frequently that it affects their ability to live their daily life. This is known as sensory processing disorder, or SPD. It's seen most often in children or those with autism. SPD can present itself in several ways, but it's usually a combination of over-responsiveness and under-responsiveness. Over-responders are overly sensitive to certain sensory inputs, creating a feeling of chaos. If a child is oversensitive to the feeling of clothing, he might avoid wearing a coat, even in a snowstorm. Under-responders aren't sensitive enough to their environment. They seek out more intense sensations to produce a reaction. These children might be constantly fidgeting and moving in class. They may ignore their work and even their own safety. This internal lack of harmony can lead to negative behaviors, anxiety, social difficulty, and trouble focusing. But SPD can be overcome. An occupational therapist can provide sensory integration therapy and modifications to help someone with SPD manage their day-to-day -day life. Through intervention, modifications, and support, someone with SPD can function harmoniously once again.